Good evening. Two brothers in Sarasota County are in hot water this evening. Deputies tell us those guys pointed a laser at a sheriff's office helicopter. That's not only dangerous, it's illegal. Chip Osowski joins us now live from the sheriff's office, and these two could face federal charges as well. I mean, this is big trouble stuff. They absolutely could, Jen, and according to deputies, that will be up to the FBI to decide, but that just gives you an idea of just how serious this situation is. In this video provided by the sheriff's office, you can see the two men at this home on Andancian Lane in Sarasota. When the men pointed the lasers at the sheriff's office chopper, the screen goes dark. The camera was blinded, as were the pilots. Imagine if you're driving a car at night in a very dark area and somebody were to uh, take a very bright flashlight and shine it in your eyes for a second. It's going to be very hard to maintain control of that car. Well, a laser does the same thing over much larger distances. But unlike commercial or private pilots whose only recourse is to report incidents such as this, when you laser deputies, their recourse is to find who's responsible. And that's just what they did. You know, you're going to get caught. The beauty about a laser is it tells us exactly where it's coming from. So, you know, keep doing it and, and you are going to get caught. Deputies tracked down 25-year-old Gary Bennington and his younger brother Matthew. Both now face charges for pointing that laser at the aircraft. And the FAA is reporting in 2014 alone there were more than 3,800 laser incidents reported. To date, none have resulted in an accident. The, the pilot I spoke with this afternoon with the sheriff's office told me if this type of behavior continues, it's only a matter of time before one of these incidents does result in an accident. Reporting in Sarasota, I'm Chip Osowski, News Channel 8.